Hey everybody, so I'm coming at you with like a brand new video. I'm actually really excited to talk about it. It's a new subscription service and I signed up for one bag just to see how I like it. It is called Elope Beauty Mail. I'm not exactly sure if you've ever heard of them because they're kind of newer. I think they've only been out for a couple months and I've only seen a few YouTube videos. And I don't know why I signed up because I was kind of scared based on the products that were in the videos because they kind of seem crappy. But I decided to sign up anyways and I'm completely pleased with my products. They're kind of like Ipsy in a way. It seems like they're trying to do the same thing as them. It comes in this pink packaging like this. And it has a little beauty mail sticker on the back. Now the website says you get five to seven full-size products. That is a little different than Ipsy because you do not always get full-size products in your Ipsy bag. Elope is $18 a month and Ipsy is $10 a month, so that's just a little comparison. When Elope started out, they didn't really have the best packaging. I mean, all the products came in this bag with tissue paper and just the products, so I'm really happy to see that they upgraded. So, the bag that they now have looks like this with a bunch of cute little A's all over it. And I also got another product. First thing I got was the Stila pencil case thing. It's actually like a brush holder or you can just use it as a dump bag or hold your lip glosses in. It just has a few slots there. And I know Stila isn't cheap, so that was one of the things. It's not, steel is expensive, so this has to be worth a little bit of money. Okay, the first thing I got was this Malibu Glitz blush. It is so pretty. I'm actually wearing it today. I absolutely love it, and it is a full-size product. This is in color Wild Rose, and I can't open it. Well, what the hell? There we go. The inside looks like that. It has this pretty little rose. And when swatched on my finger, it is like this really crazy bright color. And I'm like, where am I ever going to wear this? Because it was just so pigmented. But then I applied it on my hand and it kind of sheared up a little bit. Not very much, but it did. And it's still pretty deep, but then when it's applied with a brush, it looks amazing. I absolutely love this color. I think it's perfect for fall. The second thing I got is the Straight Sexy Hair Deep Conditioning Mask for Thick Coarse Hair. It is 1.7 fluid ounces. And I'm not really sure if this is a full-size product or not because I've never bought sexy hair before because they are crazy expensive. And I just... I can't spend that kind of money on something for my hair and probably not like it, so I'm really excited that I got this. I do have really damaged hair because of how much I dye it to keep it black. So I'm excited about that. If anyone knows if this is full size or not, let me know because I honestly have no idea. Okay, the third thing I got was the Salon Effects from Sally Hansen. It's just the nail stickers. Now, I'll probably never use this as I don't have fingernails, and when I do glue them on, they pop off within a day, and I'm not supposed to wear them to work anyway because it's a safety hazard. So this might just go in a giveaway, or I might just give it to my sister since she's obsessed with fingernails. Okay, I was so stoked about getting this product because I've never tried anything from this brand before. It is from Hard Candy, and I have hair on my face, and it's itching. Okay, it's from Hard Candy, and it's an eyeshadow. This is in color... What color is this? I forget. Infatuation. And it's just this pretty basic sheer color here. Swatched on my finger, it looks like that. Now it's really smooth compared to my NYX eyeshadow, and I thought I loved that, but I think I actually like this one more. And it looks amazing with a base such as the NYX eyeshadow I mean that really makes it adhere to your eyes I wore it for over 12 hours and that color didn't budge and it was just so pretty I'll probably wear it next time with a little bit of glitter because I do love glitter but I absolutely love that and I'm so excited that I got to try hard candy 
then the last and final thing that I did get is this Steel Lip Rogue pencil. I think that's what it's called. It's like this felt tip pencil here. And when applied, it's this pretty plummy color right in the middle here. Now on the camera, it's appearing more red, but it's actually more plummy, and it's the perfect fall color. Now the first time I used it, I didn't necessarily like it, but now I like it. It used to like sink into your cracks of your lips, and I applied a lip balm, and then put that on, and it kind of screwed up the tip. But now I actually like that it screwed up the tip, because I'm like, holy crap, I just ruined it. But it applies so much better. It doesn't like sink into my cracks or anything. The only thing I have a complaint about is it says store with this side down so it can like drain to the top or something like that. And when you're trying to apply it to your upper lid, lid, upper lip, it doesn't apply as well because now it's pointed up. So it's a much sheer color than on the bottom. So I'm not really sure how to work with that, but I'm going to try to figure it out because I really do like this color. So that's basically everything I got in my Elope Beauty Mail bag. If you're interested in signing up, I'll link all the information below so you can sign up. Now they do have it so you can sign up every month, or it's just like a subscription. Before you had to sign up every month, but now you can just sign up and it will just come out of your bank account. My official thoughts are I love this way better than my first Ipsy bag. Just because the products... I like the products a lot better than what I got in my Ipsy. I don't know, that's basically it. I know it's only, it's $8 more than Ipsy, but I thought this bag was totally worth it, and I'm probably going to stay with them for another month or two. Hopefully I'm not getting the bad products that some of the other people are getting. I don't know why, I think maybe, I don't know, it could be just because they were new and they were trying to see the feedback that people are giving, but this bag is awesome, and I haven't seen any videos posted within the last few days uh, since these bags were sent out with the same type of products. So I'm not sure if everyone gets the same thing or not. Um, let's see. I did contact customer service because I didn't know if my order went through or whatnot because I didn't get an email or anything until a couple days later and they do have good customer service. They did email me with the tracking number when it got shipped out. It took about five days to get here since the shipment date or whatever. And I don't know where it shipped from, but it came pretty quick and it, I don't know, I've just had a really good experience with this first bag, so I'm hoping to have a really good second bag. If you have any questions that you want to ask me, feel free, or you can just go to the website and contact Elope themselves or just look through the website. Now the website isn't as advanced as other subscription services, but they're working on it, they're new, so you just have to give them a chance. And I know with beauty subscriptions, it's always a hit or miss. And so far, this is a hit. Hopefully, they're all hits, but, you know, you're never that lucky. Um, another thing is you pick your, like, style or whatever. I picked the Adventurous. Just send me a bunch of different types of products. So that's what I picked. Maybe that's why I got this bag. I have no idea. And I'm going to pick the Adventurous for my next month, too. Alright guys, so that's just what I want to share with you. I didn't know if you heard of them because there's really not much out there about them. They do have a Facebook page too. I'll link that below. So yeah, I don't know. Just run and check them out. I think the bag was totally worth it this month. Alright guys, thanks for watching.